what's up gamers gamer dad here back for another item shop review it is saturday october 21st just past 8 p.m eastern standard time in canada which means we have an item shop refresh I want to give a shout out to everyone who subscribed in the past 24 hours but due to your privacy settings i can't see your name and give you a proper shout out if you're watching you haven't done so yet please do hit that subscribe button and show me that support and lastly don't forget to use my creator code in your fortnite item shop it is gamer dad all one word all capital letters thank you so much for your support and without further ado let's get into the review as you can see, we have a new locker bundle this evening. It is Nikoff locker bundle, I believe. Nikoff, Nikoff. Regardless, let's take a closer look. So within Nikoff's locker bundle, we have the Bracer outfit from the Modern Mercenary set, Season 9. This is a decent looking outfit. It's not like amazing or anything, but it's not too bad. We then have the Bootstraps pickaxe. I'm not a favorite of this one. I don't know. There's something goofy about it. And then we have the Bandage Wrap from season eight and the rhinestone rider glider from season five 1500 v bucks for that bundle otherwise you get the outfit the pickaxe glider or wrap on their own looks like the kid Leroy is back in the item shop this evening so the first bundle is the kid Leroy bundle it's the traditional kid Leroy outfit here it's got four different styles you've got the hat style or just the hair you can turn the glasses on or off and then you have the electrified style or the regular Kid Leroy style. You also get the Get My Bag Back Bling, which has two different styles. Then the Rogue Leroy outfit. This one's a little bit more odd, in my opinion. It's got four different options. Rogue. Rogue with no hat. And then the electrified. And the skull version. You also get the Tragic Blade Back Bling with the Tragic Blade pickaxe. And of course you can unsheath the pickaxe from the back bling when both are equipped. And lastly, the Leroy Freestyle Reactive Wrap. So it's 2,400 V-Bucks for that bundle. We also have the Leroy's Party Starter Bundle. So you got that Heart of a King emote, the Stay Afloat emote, the Dance Leroy emote. Then we have the Stay Music as well as the Wild Dreams loading screen. So it's 1,000 V-Bucks for that bundle and if you don't want the bundles you can pick up any of the other items except the loading screen on their own on to the featured item category we have peely bone introduced in chapter 2 season 1 along with a built-in xylo bone emote this one's pretty hilarious 1500 v bucks we then have the shadow midas outfit i'm a big fan of the midas outfits this one you don't see quite as much it's from chapter 2 season 8 um, you got a shadow effect on the outfit grows as you get more and more eliminations. And you got the shadow touch. So unlike the other one where it's a golden touch, you can apply a shadow wrap to any equipped weapon, which is kind of cool. And you can also turn the reactivity off or have it on. 1500 V-Bucks. We've got the Sanctum outfit up next from Season 6, the Night Coven set. Two different outfit styles. It also comes with the Coven Cape of Back Bling. Also with two styles, and these items will be 1,500 V-Bucks. Then we've got the Moonrise Pickaxe from Season 6. Kind of cool looking. Two styles, 1,200 V-Bucks. We also have the Cryptic Curse Bundle, featuring the Wrath Outfit. We've got four different styles here. I like the uh, the coat with that hat. It's actually pretty cool. You got the Timekeeper Back Bling. It also has four styles that are unlocked um, with the Wrath Challenges there. We then have the Cursed Claws Pickaxe. And by the way, those additional styles for the outfit uh, itself are also uh, unlocked as you can complete Quest. So it's 1600 V-Bucks for that bundle. Next up we have the daily items, and first up is Relay from Season 9. Like a desert style camo here, along with that toque, which is kind of cool. 800 V-Bucks. We have the Shadow Ops outfit from Season 1, the Stealth Syndicate set. It's got two different outfit styles. And comes with the Prospect Back Bling, which also has two styles for 1500 V-Bucks. We then have the Fork Knife Pickaxe for 500. We have the Confused Emote from Season 3 for 500 V-Bucks. The Fire Spinner Emote from Season 8 is 800 V-Bucks. And we have the Rage Quit Emote from Season 10 for 200 V-Bucks. And that would be it for new additions to the item shop this evening. From previous nights, we still have the Walking Dead items, the brand new FNCS Global Championship 2023, 
Got all those Marvel items that just came out. Rick and Morty are still here. Dragon Ball Super. Item shop is too packed, in my opinion. They need to move some stuff out. The Fortnite Mares category continues to grow. And, of course, that Transformers pack was introduced last evening, and that is pretty sweet, in my opinion. So in terms of my favorite additions to the item shop this evening, I like the Shadow Midas outfit um, as my favorite. And that Cryptic Curse bundle is actually pretty cool, too. So comment down below. Let me know what your favorite item is. Let me never pick it up anything from the shop tonight. Please drop a like in the video, and if you're watching and you haven't done so yet, please do hit that subscribe button and show me that support. And don't forget to use my creator code in your Fortnite item shop. It is GamerDad, all one word, all capital letters. Have yourselves a great evening, and until the next video, this is GamerDad out.